It was a bill named after an eight-year-old who was shot and killed by her 11-year-old friend. And today, Republicans in the House defeated Michaela's law aimed at holding gun owners more responsible for their weapons around children. Chris Conti is live now near the state capitol. Chris, what prompted lawmakers to vote against it? The NRA, Vicki, for the last few weeks, they've been urging members to keep this bill from moving forward. Michaela's law effectively died last night in a closed-door meeting that some Democrats are calling a secret. Press was not allowed, where no one else was allowed. This was not the kind of press conference Representative Sherry Jones wanted to hold today. They had this meeting. Standing before reporters discussing the defeat of a bill named after an eight year old girl. The Republicans aren't in any mood to keep children safe from guns and gun violence and gun deaths. Michaela's law was named after Michaela Dyer. She was shot and killed by her 11-year-old friend in East Tennessee last year. The bill was simply drawn to help make irresponsible gun owners more aware that it's their responsibility to keep children safe. Along party lines, Republicans voted today to defeat the bill 7-2. to two. It's sad. It's Frankly, it's shameful. Beth Jocelyn Roth worked closely with Michaela's family to draft the law that would hold gun owners more responsible if someone under the age of 13 killed or injured someone using their firearm. Today, sadly, um, our legislators just sort of shrugged their shoulders and indicated that they have no interest in, in addressing the problem. A tragedy happens and people look to government to say, fix this so this never happens again. You can't always do that. Representative John Lundberg chairs the committee which voted the bill down. Most members had made up their mind during a closed door meeting last night. Did the NRA have anything to do with this? No, no. So, um, now I can't say. Did, they, I mean, did the NRA approach you? I talked, literally, I talked to the NRA in the hallway for about five seconds. So do you think the NRA killed this bill? Yes, I do. A crushing defeat for a bill named after a little girl who no longer has a voice. It just means we'll work a little bit harder and we'll bring it back next year. House Democrats say this is not the end of Michaela's law. They plan on reintroducing it next legislative session. We're live at Bicentennial Mall this evening. Chris Conti, News Channel 5. Chris, thanks.